the end is near. It How are you is. feeling? Um, I, well, excited really. You know, I think the festival has gone well this year. You know, I've certainly enjoyed what I've seen of the festival. You know, I've loved presenting the films that I've presented and all the filmmakers that I've worked with this year have been just, you know, so kind of willing to talk to their audiences and, you know, be very generous with their time and very articulate. So, so of course, you know, it feels, it feels strange to be, you know, having the last night of my last festival. But I've done the festival for 15 years now. So, you know, it is time for me to do something different, I think. And, you know, I feel very comfortable about the fact that the festival is in good shape and therefore sort of handing it over now seems like a, the right time to do that. I think what's nice about the film festival, it gets a good balance with kind of the, the sort of bigger budget um, film, filming and filmmakers and, and also the sort of lower budget. And, and for you as a coordinator, do, do the bigger budget films allow then um, a, an audience that wouldn't normally see the normal films open open it up really? Yeah, that's exactly right. I mean, the high profile films, you know, gain a lot of attention. But I always think of those being the films that kind of, you know, they shine the light on some of the films that aren't so well known. And that's really important to us. You know, we have films in the festival from 55 different countries and it's hard to think at any other time of the year when audiences in London could have quite that spread. You know, we've got artist film and video and archive films as well as all these amazing new films. So, you know, for me, the festival has always been about that variety and that spread and about saying, you know, just because the film is from a filmmaker that you've never heard of or indeed from a country that you've never heard of, you know, doesn't mean that you should dismiss it. And actually, the festival is a good way of promoting exactly those kind of films. The other, the other nice thing that we've obviously speaking to the filmmakers across the fest festival is that the, what this festival does is give them the acknowledgement as well that their hard work and, and, and labour has been has been recognised and acknowledged. Really? Yeah, absolutely. And I think getting you know making any film is such an achievement and such hard work. You know, it sort of breaks my heart that we turn a lot of films down for the festival because every time I watch a film, I'm aware of just how much of someone's life has gone into it. But you know, when we do select films and we can you know present them in the best way that we can and give a platform to them and you know introduce the filmmakers too I think that's absolutely what festivals should be all about and and how obviously that film is is art it's, it's a motion picture um, but how have you grown as an artist over the last 50 years well I think I think you know, my tastes are very broad in terms of cinema and I think, you know, working on the festival has only helped that to, you know, kind of develop really. So, you know, just in terms of the festival, you know, I love the artist film and video work that we show, you know, that's kind of where I came from. But I also love the fact that we show the George Clooney film and he shows up to introduce it. So, you know, so I think in terms of developing my own taste and also my understanding of what it really does take to make a film, I think the festival's been very educational. I think the other thing that it's been really great for me to see is that audiences will also be kind of interested in that broad range of work you know because most of the year audiences here don't have access to that you know they get a fairly limited diet so it's amazing when we run the festival to see all these audiences coming out in large numbers for a really broad spread of work thank you very much Sandra. My pleasure. and very nice best of luck with the future you. and thank you, you.